I grew up here as a 4-H kiddo and everybody knows my mom, Denise Smith. So grew up in the office and as secretaries have come and gone and circumstances have um, dictated, I have kind of stepped in and filled this position um, several times. So tons of history and extension. Our office is definitely a team, which is huge. And we have a lot of fun working together. <laughs> And sometimes we do kind of scratch our head and says, now whose crazy idea was this one? And how did we get this far into it? So we've been doing 4-H Fridays um, since LUSC went to a four-day school week um, starting last September. We do a 4-H activity from nine to noon every single Friday that is open to every school-age child um, in Niagara County that wants to participate. So we've actually reached quite a few kids here in Niagara County that maybe wouldn't have ended up in traditional 4-H. And when everything got really crazy in March, we didn't even miss a beat. Um, so they canceled school on that Tuesday. They went to school on Monday. They canceled school for Tuesday. And we did our first virtual 4-H Friday that Friday um, via Facebook Live. And so each week we put together a, a bag of supplies. So for their snack and the activity, when COVID hit in March and all of a sudden we couldn't do anything in person and we still needed to be reaching people, um, it definitely was the shove off the cliff that maybe the nutrition and food safety team needed. And we started doing the Facebook live videos. And um, I think that's one thing that has been really fun to kind of watch as we have learned how to do those videos and do them better and seen the reach that we have. Um, like this year at State Fair, Denise would walk down the midway and people would be like, hey, we watch you on Facebook. People that we would have never interacted with that now follow along. I really enjoy just getting to see everybody all the time and interacting with the 4-H families and our community. Um, like I've said, our office is a huge part of Nyberg County and um, it's not uncommon for the UPS driver to roll in and say, I have packages for these three people. They told me they'd be in this week. I'm just leaving them here. And with every funeral, wedding and event happening here, um, we just see a ton of our community all the time, which is really nice because it keeps extension right in the kind of the spotlight in Niagara County. I think that's the great part about Extension is you are always learning, whether it's us in the office or those that we're um, sharing that knowledge with, there's always something to be learned.